everybody. We are prepping for Thanksgiving. Um, didn't open up this vlog. Um, here we go. <laughs> but anyway, just went to get all of the supplies, the groceries for Thanksgiving. The stuff that I had to purchase here at the house because I am hosting Thanksgiving this year. And my family, my mom's side of the family is coming over. And then uh, they will bring, my mom is bringing a couple of more um, food items up when I pick her up. Tuesday, today is Sunday. And we're about to get started. I just left Walmart um, getting the rest of the groceries that I need to get. And then Bay is going to light the fireplace so I can put put all this stuff away. And um, I'm going to make dinner for tonight. And then hopefully I can relax for the rest of the day. But let me show you what I'm working with. So we pretty much got all of the meat taken care of. So I just had to go and get like stuff like potatoes, onion. My mama actually has the bell pepper. Um, got some cheese, because I'm gonna make some mashed potatoes, some garlic mashed potatoes. They always ask me to make garlic mashed potatoes, my cousin. Um, got stuff for dressing. I gotta put away, what else I got in here? These are potatoes for the mashed potatoes. These potatoes here are for the green beans and um, the roast. I got some eggs. Got two gallons of milk because I'm gonna make a cake and I'm gonna make some sweet potato pies. I'll do this with one hand. Um, we didn't feel like fooling with green beans, so we're just gonna spice these up with some boiling meat. Get them all ready to go. Put some potatoes in them. Um, like I said, I'm gonna make a cake. I got my baking supplies. I'm gonna make a old-fashioned chocolate cake, and I'll. Um, I'll vlog that as well if I get a chance. I'm not real good at vlogging while I'm while I'm working, while I'm doing stuff. Um, potatoes, what else I got? Cornmeal mix. They didn't have the, um, I usually get the Martha White, the um, self-rising cornmeal mix. I just poked a hole in it. I knew I was gonna poke a hole in it. Um, they didn't have that, so I got the Pearl Millen and Jemima, the OF Jemima brand. So I got that, some sugar. I just bought one five pound bag because I have a, a large bag already in the pantry. And I got some unsalted butter. I got two sticks of that. What else I got? This is the worst haul video. I know guys, but like, didn't wanna bore you guys with this. But anyway, barbecue sauce. And my mom's gonna make a shoulder, a pork shoulder, or a bag's gonna put it on the grill. I don't know which one. But I didn't see the um, barbecue sauce that we usually like. And I don't care for like sweet barbecue sauce. I got this Carolina barbecue sauce, which should be more of like a, I'm hoping like a um, vinegar base. I'm gonna try this out and I'll let y'all know how, how I like this. Figure we'll mix it with the Sunnies. And then my mom just called actually, and she is at Kroger. And Kroger has the, um, what is it? The, um, can't even think of the barbecue sauce. I'll, I'll insert a picture. I'll insert a picture right here. <laughs> Can't even think of the name of it, but it's the one that I really want. So my mom's gonna pick that up um, from Kroger today. And then I bought cake pans. Um, I have some um, cake pans, but these will be easier with that traditional like 10 layer cake, nine layer cake. I'm gonna make nine layers because I got nine cake pans. So that'd be good. I got another mixer. Um, I have a mixer, but it's really, really old. It still works, but I was like, let me just grab another mixer. What else do I have here? Let's see. Let me put the camera down. Hold on. All right. So, oh, so this is the turkey injection kit. We got two turkeys. Um, I actually have one more kit in the pantry already that's left over from, I can't remember, we fried the turkey for something. All for um, the cakes and the dressing, cornbread and stuff. I bought peanut oil um, for the turkey. That's outside. I think they put that in the in the garage. And then in here I have Lord, did the guy tie knots on out of that? Um, got me some minced garlic. I use this in the garlic cheese mashed potatoes. I got some vinegar so we can make some cucumber and onion. You know what I mean, the mix. Got some sweet potatoes because I'm gonna make a sweet potato pie. I thought I got four potatoes. Did I only get two? 
Maybe one is in another bag. I thought about four. But I'll make some sweet potato pies. Um, and then a pantry. I need to clean this pantry out before I start putting more stuff in. Let's see what we got. All right, so all these cans. My mom actually had already started buying stuff for Thanksgiving, so she got um, the cream of chicken, cream of celery soup. I went and got some cranberry sauce. Um, so we got all that. And then chicken broth. I just brought that. <coughs> Excuse me. I just brought this chicken broth in the house. Um, but I need to clean all this stuff off. Um, water, I need to get. And then she got some pans from Party City. I don't know if I need any more pans or not. I don't think so. But I need to clean all this stuff up, get it straightened up so I can put these groceries away. Yeah, so I don't think I'm going to do much today. Um, yesterday, I kind of, I wanted to lay around yesterday, but I ended up kind of being out, um, washing clothes, trying to, uh, I fi finished up the trees finally. That's in my other vlog, so if you guys get a chance, go check out my tree trimming vlog uh, but the tree is up i usually love to have my tree up for thank well i always have my tree up for thanksgiving i don't know if there's ever been a year that i did not have my tree up for thanksgiving oh shoot you got some more groceries so i need to put these uh my son brought the groceries in i didn't even realize there was some right here but i got my celery some more butter i need to put these in the freezer my um pie crust for sweet potato pie put these in the freezer now Um, some carrots for the roast. What else we have? I don't went from one thing to the other. <laughs> I bought a ham. I like these hams better than the spiral hams. I, I like, I prefer this kind of ham. Got some, um, more milk. And yeah, that's it. So not much more. But today I'm gonna try to lay around a little bit. Um, I'm gonna cook dinner. I took out some some shrimp so I'm gonna make some pasta and a sec as soon as I get this all cleared away get the pantry straightened out gonna make some pasta and then we're gonna have dinner and like I said I think I said already today is Sunday um, I'm good I may work a little bit tomorrow and maybe a little bit Tuesday I don't plan on doing much for work um, most of my co-workers everybody is kind of like laying low taking off but I do have a few things to kind of catch up for for work. So I might do that in the morning. And then after that, I'm done. But I'm going to go pick up my mom. She lives about 45 minutes away. I'm going to pick up my mom on Tuesday. Bring her back. She's bringing collard greens. Um, stuff for macaroni and cheese. And just like other things, like I was saying, she got some barbecue sauce. She got some more stuff. So she's, pick she's bringing that when I pick her up. And then we'll get started cooking on Wednesday. to burn it while I was cooking. This is the, what is this? Yeah, the frosted cranberry. I love that one, but it's almost gone. So I'm gonna go get some more candles or another candle. And I've gotten everything put away. I got the pantry wiped down, got everything kind of put away like I need it just for right now. But this is where I keep all my candles in the pantry. Um, so I'm gonna get another one of these. I'll start this one. And then I don't have any more. So I think they had the three weeks on sale for um, $13.50. But when I got my last batch, they were, I think they were $12.50. I can't remember. Or three for 10. I'm mean, sorry, three for three for something. I can't remember. But anyway, but I got tons of this, the one, the single wicks. Um, and I'll keep them in the trays. I have a bunch of them left in here have these and then I keep all of my um wallflowers 
in this little container here and then i also have some some um air wick ones as well but i i'll stock up on these when they um go on sale and i'll get a lot of them and they pretty much last so i'm gonna grab this one and start this baby up and let me show you so i still smell it smell the other one but i might let it burn for a little bit more so before i burn this one let me show you what i have here all right so i don't know if you guys have seen these before but the electric um electric lighters i've had this particular one for about a year um but they're good to have if you are a candle burner which i am i'm not like i don't burn candles every day but several times a week we do go through candles but um this is very convenient you don't have to worry about matches or running out of um, the fuel in a lighter but you simply charge these up and i'll drop a link if i can still have it um for amazon i got these from amazon i have one upstairs and i keep this one downstairs so the one upstairs is a pink one and then this is a black one um but you simply like let me see push it up so you push it up and this one needs to be charged but if it was fully charged it'll have um four blue indicator lights that would be fully charged but this part here is where if you match this button down here it starts sparking and then that's what you stick on the wick and it lights your candle for you hey guys i'm back we're ready for thanksgiving got the tree up i don't have it turned on right now but if you um get a chance go check check out our christmas tree trimming video i got all the footage um of me getting this tree set up it came out really good this year i really enjoy setting up my tree and making sure i have it ready for thanksgiving so that is up um i went through and pulled out my trays and dishes that i need for thanksgiving just to make sure i didn't need to buy anything i did that yesterday um i also um what did i do went grocery shopping i think i showed you guys that yeah, got my groceries. That was yesterday as well. And then today, Bay is outside um, cutting the grass. He's not really cutting it because it's dormant right now, but he likes to go over it again, get up any um, leaves, you know, just kind of like level it off again. And this will be the last time that he'll cut it for the, for the year. He won't cut it again until the springtime, but he's outside taking care of that. And I'm going to go in here and fix us some tuna because today is Monday um and i'm not trying to cook too much tomorrow we'll eat out wednesday we'll eat out and then of course thursday is thanksgiving i don't know if you guys seen that tiktok video where the child is asking her mom for something to eat and it's like a week out from from thanksgiving and the mom is like i'm cooking thanksgiving next week go fix your sandwich that's what this reminds me of but anyway um i'm about to go fix up something to eat and hopefully babe doesn't have too much more to go um, it's a little dark outside. Let's see. So, yeah, it's kind of dark. Yeah, he should be done because he's blowing the yard now. He's blowing everything. So, he did the front. And, hey, guys, I did put those two pumpkins. I put those two pumpkins out there. I'll show you guys that later. But in the meantime, let me close the store. It's cool out there. Um, I'm about to get us some tuna going. Got my eggs on. Hey fam, I'm back. So it's Wednesday um, and I'm just getting up and out. It is 1130. I needed to come to pick up a couple of things from Walmart and um, stop by the store um, before I get started this morning picked up my mom yesterday so she's at the house and she is getting started with prep work cooking and stuff and i'm going to pick up a couple of these items and uh, go back home and help her so today we'll get some of the food done i really like my food to be cooked on thanksgiving but there are some things that i can definitely do before thanksgiving my mom would probably prefer to cook everything the day before um but i don't know i just like my stuff especially like my collard greens i want them cooked that day even though collard greens are really good the next day but i like i, I want it thanksgiving morning i want things to be cooked thanksgiving morning so um but we're getting things prepped so that we don't have a long day 
um, in the morning or a long morning. That way we can kind of relax with everybody else because uh, we're going to eat at 2.30. And usually, if I say a time, I'll meet that time. Yeah, I will. That doesn't mean that all my cousins, my sisters will be there at 2.30. They probably will. They probably will. But doesn't mean everybody's going to be there. But baby, when I have Thanksgiving at my house, I try. I try to make sure I have everything at my house. Nobody's bringing a dish or anything that we're going to be waiting on. I just tell them, just have everything, you know, to me. And I'll make sure it's ready at the time that I set. And if you're not there, no problem. We're going to eat at 2.30. You just come in to eat, you know, when you get there. No problem. No worries. But anyway, um, so we're going to eat about 2.30 tomorrow. Um, but today we're going to start cooking. I actually didn't feel like getting up out of the bed this morning. I mean, I wasn't asleep. I just start when I wake up. I woke up about quarter to eight this morning. And I didn't get out of the bed until about 1030. Um, but I'll get on my phone, start reading stuff, reading articles. And I go down this crazy rabbit hole, which I did this morning. And I get stuck and then until I finish like whatever reading I need to do. And then I get up and get dressed. So that's what happened this morning. So I'm kind of off to a late start, but hey, I got all day. So we'll get started. But anyway, I'm running this store and then I'll meet you guys back at home. Back at home, got everything I need. Just talked to my sister, um, see what we're about to do with these babies. Make sure they have something to do, something to play with, keep them entertained. Um, my mama, when I got back, my mama had started. Um, she started, I think she got the boiling meat on, but she over there chilling. She's not going to let me put her on video. And Bay is outside. So I came outside. It's so nice. Um, no, I'm not sure about you guys and where you are. But here at my house, it is really, really nice this Wednesday before Thanksgiving. So that makes it a lot easier. <laughs> Bay said, hey, y'all. What's up, Bay? He said, what's up? <laughs> it makes it a lot easier to kind of cook, be in the kitchen all day. Because it's such a nice day. But he's about to fire up the grill because I think he, what you got to smoke a, he got to do some Boston butts and what else? Just that, just the Boston butt? Yeah. So he got to take care of the Boston butt so they can get done and my mama's going to pull the pork, you know, pull it apart or whatever. So we'll have pulled pork for tomorrow. But yeah, this is what we're up to. I, I really need to stop procrastinating because that's what I'm doing. I need to get started. I need to get started. You think I'm I'm procrastinating? He said, yeah. <laughs> I am. Let me get started. All right, let's go to the kitchen. <laughs> Things are going to sleep. I have taken my jacket off because it got a little hot, but it's been easy this year. Pretty much got everything going, everything on. I'm about to make the cornbread for the dressing. I just put my sweet potatoes in the oven for my pies. I gotta take my baby to work um, in a couple of hours. So I wanna have the, the bread, the cornbread ready, potatoes ready. I take them out before I take him to work. And then I gotta make a chocolate cake when I come back, but I won't start that until I take him to work. And then that's it. That's it for the night, y'all. I haven't been filming. I need to turn the camera on in the kitchen, but y'all, I'm just moving around, walking around. Um, I'll see if I can try to turn the camera on um, for a little while, but yeah. So far, so good. It's Thanksgiving, y'all. <laughs> so really, really, what's going on? What's really going on out here? What you doing? Chilling and grilling. Chilling and grilling, cause he ain't cooking. I don't consider this cooking. This can't be cooking. Y'all, he told me he tanning. <laughs> he said he tanning. <laughs> Come get him. Meanwhile, me and my mama in the kitchen. That's all right. Things are going smoothly. He letting these things smoke. They already looking good.
And the last two will be relim- eliminated. And then you do a final. We'll move it up closer. We'll move it up closer. After the first round, we'll move it up closer. Look at Ray. She ready. <laughs> she raised it. <laughs> Go, Ray. I counted down.